the little things uh-huh. Every day's more complete when you can enjoy uh-huh. The simple things, uh-huh. the simple things uh-huh. A little more convenient can go a long, long way You'll be amazed how much time you save you When you leave the star nine of all hush and life Star nine of all hush Oh yeah, I'm great to shop, shop, retired like pam, 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 pam Star nine of all hush Wherever you are to reload is easy like pam, 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 pam Star nine of all hush Shells down, star nine of all hush and with one single dial, you recharge like bum, 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 bum. Buy airtime instantly, directly from your bank account. Simply dial star 904 star, the amount of airtime you want and hash. You're tuned in to the Front Page News on Classic FM 97.3. Good morning, it's a beautiful Wednesday and yes, glad to be here as always. Front page news and analysis is what you are listening to. The 1st of November, it is a brand new uh, month. Jimmy is in the studio with us and my name is Bukola. Remember, you can always be a part. Just send your text messages to 33973. Also, tweet at ClassicFM973 with the hashtag FPN and on our Facebook page as well. Facebook.com forward slash ClassicFM973. Good morning, Jimmy. Good morning, good morning, everybody. All right. Uh, we're starting with the Nigerian Tribune here. Mayna fights back through aid. How I stopped 5.32 billionaire from being stolen monthly in two offices. Ease of doing business. World Bank rates Nigeria high. At NPC NEC meeting, Buhari says more ministers coming to reconstitute board of parastatal agencies to APC's gov- NPC governors endorse him for second term as Odigo Yegu survives removal plot. Benway, supporters of anti grazing bill of protest. Wanda declares 7.1 billion euro profit after tax in third quarter. News Watch, Jimo Ibrahim wins at appeal court. Corruption Monitoring Committee, NGC replaces Salami with Galadima. From the Vanguard, 2019 APC governors back automatic ticket for Buhari. Ease of doing business, Buhari delighted as Nigeria improves in World Bank rating. Jonathan Dasuki asked Justice Abank to hands off me to his trial. Pension thieves after me, says Mena. Luther's trial and Jesse replaces Salami with Galadima. You have done well, APC caucus, neck tell Buhari, and that is from the nation. Panel duties may be time wasting, says Salami. 200,000 living with HIV in Ibadan, says Naka. A con to host Afrima 2017 in Glegost. In Lagos, I beg your pardon. Rot to home eagles, I won't forget you. EFCC resumes probe of Osborne's 43.4 million dollars. And we start with this in detail. APC neck meeting. Governor's bid to get automatic 2019 ticket for Buhari fails. A move by some governors on the platform of the All Progressive Congress to use the platform of the National Executive Council of the party to endorse President Mohamed Buhari for a second term <laughs> failed on Tuesday. The APC NEC is the second highest decision-making body of the party after the National Convention. Two years after retired General Mohamed Buhari took, uh, took up the mantle of leadership of the country, He now recognizes the need for him to play politics. Was this a deliberate tactics on tactic on his part? Were these deliberate tactics, you know, on his part? He's the only one who can answer that question in reality. But yesterday he started playing politics. Now, is he playing politics because he wants to run in 2019, or that he would rather narrow down the fights that he has? Because apparently. He has so many things on his plate to occupy his mind now. The, most of it, of course, being his credibility in the minor case and the Lawal and Oke case. So he ran to his, that's where I'd like to put it, you know, as a journalist, that he ran to his constituency to gain ground, okay? Maybe just to make him, maybe just to stabilize him or to prepare the ground again, like I said, for 2019. Some you read one report there that said that the the the, the, the governors gave him some automatic ticket mm. that didn't happen because all the other papers said that he indeed 
one 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 um, news uh, one news um, one 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 of, one of the papers said that it was quote and unquote somebody in the crowd who moved the motion that they should endorse Buhari for 2019, and of course it failed. Why did it fail? The average member of the APC, apart from those of us in the public, is not happy with Buhari for other reasons apart from those that concern us. And simply put, the APC members, a lot of them believe that an article articulated that fact, and incidentally, article wasn't, wasn't at that meeting yesterday, that Buhari should change them. He didn't, like you'd always say in political parlance, carry them along. He hasn't carried them along. How do you carry? I mean, two years down the line, you, 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 most of your, your boards, you don't have board members. You, I, I'm not even sure if you have ambassadors. I'm, I can't remember. But you don't have board members. Which is, these are the things that are very crucial for politicians to take care of their constituencies. Because the politics we, pay, we play, like would happen in any poverty-reading environment, because that's, that's what we are, is the politics of money and patronage. And most of them have been found wanting. So, the gentleman now is going to, he says he's going to reshuffle his cabinet, open up the space for more politicians to come in, most likely. Uh, he, he said that he had been working on constituting the boards and whatever since November 2015. And in a four year tenure, even that admission by the president is very, very embarrassing. Well, it and took bad. six months to get ministers. It took six months to get ministers. What we have is a man who is very slow in action and who, it takes him a while to face the realities that confront him. And that is not good for us. We need somebody, I don't know whether it is by age or by, by his training or that's just the way he is. Buhari is just a slow, you know, I don't know whether he's slow and steady, but he's slow. Whether he's steady is, is subject to argument, but you cannot fault the fact that he's slow. Like you rightly said, six months, you know, to, uh, you know, to put together a cabinet and so on and so forth. One of the casualties of this ministerial reshuffle, I can quickly tell you, is likely to be uh, Fashola. The three ministries, you know, the three ministries given to him, he has to, he has to quote and unquote, open up the space. <laughs> if you get, uh, uh, in, in political palaces, it is hierarchy for you to put works, power, and um, what's the other one? Works, power, and what's his third uh, ministry? Housing. Housing, works power in the hands of one man. Politically, is not wise, no matter how competent you think the man is. But what is saving grace is that the man, the, he put that kind of responsibility in, in, in the, is not from the north. If he had been a northerner, maybe the country would have collapsed totally. But because he's put it in the hands of, to put it bluntly, a Yoruba person who most people like and believe is efficient, he got away with it. Politically, he cannot. So I can assume that some of the meetings that took place before yesterday's meeting, there'll be hard tackles and trade bargaining that look, if you want us to support you, you have to open up this space. Uh, for example, look at you give three whatever to just one man. When so so and so is lying down there, he hasn't had anything for two years, he too would like to have something to eat. <laughs> but <laughs> like, is that what it is all this about? Is a, this is a famous phrase that I got from a very, very close uh, 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 elderly position of man who passed away some time ago. He says something like that so that he too can have something to eat. That's all that's what it's all about. Now, the question is, where does that leave us as a people? As the politicians are gearing up towards 2019, we should also be gearing up. And we should have at the back of our minds the kind of person we want to rule this country. Like I said, Atiku was not at that briefing yesterday. The question now we want to ask is, is Atiku still in the APC? Or is he eyeing something in the PDP? Or does he have a fresh party that I'm demand? It's an unfolding drama. It's interesting. The game hasn't started yet, so you can still go and buy your popcorn and come back. The movie hasn't started. All right, next headline here. Pension thieves after me, says Mina, says he stopped stealing of 5.32 billion from eight, from head of service, uh, police pension monthly. Uh, Kat Kaduna, embattled former chairman of pension reform task team, PRTT Abdul Rashid Mina, has been alleged that he was being subjected to relentless persecution and media trial because he stopped pension thieves from stealing 5.32 billion monthly from the office of the head of service, head of service and police pension office alone. Yeah, um, this is, you know, with the Mena case, you have a development every day. Now, there's this, this gentleman who is said to be Mena's spokes, spokesperson uh, and, and he's putting up a defense for the for the guy, the, the spokesperson is called Mr. Ladide Fashikun. 
Now, look at it technically. Oladide Fashiku is speaking on behalf of Mena, which means that he has spoken to Mena. Mena is a wanted man in a criminal case. Have the police asked Fashiku how he spoke to Mena, where he where 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 Mena spoke to him, through what channel, and so on and so forth. And did Fasha Fashiku report that conversation to the police? See, these are the technicalities. It's nothing personal, but these are the little technicalities that we need to look at. Especially, in, in, you know, in cases like this. He, he, you can't be wanted on the one hand and then have a so-called spokesperson. Where were you speaking from? Your spokesperson should have one or two questions to answer. Do you know, Buki, that if Mena walks into this studio, he's a wanted man, we are duty-bound to report him to report to the police. If you say somebody is wanted, if you do not report, you become an accessory. It could be via email. It could be via could be, uh, telephone. Uh, that's well, how he communicated. Well, well, you know, that has to be established. That has to be established. And people need to be careful when they take on responsibilities like this. If a man is wanted, do you know what it is to be wanted? Yeah, okay, the, uh, loads, every day you see the papers, people are wanted. Nobody is looking for them. What in a well-run society, when you are wanted... And you don't want to show up, you go completely underground. You know, and, and, and um, Mena, I'm not interested in whatever he might have to say. He should come up. He can have his days in court. When he gets to court, he can say all kinds of things. Even once, you know, once he gets to court, he can put up all kinds of defense. But he should come out first. We're not, I'm not going to be going to sit back here and, and start placing some importance on what Mena is saying when he's, when he's in hiding. It should show up and go and defend his name and his person in court. Next headline, social media outcry, NNPC GMD cancels dinner with lawmakers. A dinner that was meant to hold at 7 p.m. on Tuesday between the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation and members of the National Assembly was cancelled by the oil firm abruptly. It was learned that the meeting, which was scheduled to hold at the Transcop meeting, Transcop meeting Hotel in Abuja, was called off following allegations in the social media that the national oil firm was trying to influence the planned probe of the NNPC Group and Managing Director Mekun T. Barra by the lawmakers. Yeah, I, I saw the, the invitation was, was in the social media ye- yesterday. I, and I, I just said to myself, there we go again. And I am glad. What, what actually excites me about all this is that it is the public that stopped this dinner from holding, insignificant as it might seem, dinner for members of National Assembly, you're talking of the Senate and House of Bread, why should a, why should a government agency be hosting the whole National Assembly in some, some dinner? And, 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 and um, uh, 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 you know, and listen to what people said. Listen to what our people said. Uh, um, a, a, tweet, a Twitter user who says, Sky A says, some states, civil servants ha- are yet to be paid their salaries. And you people are here for dinner on taxpayers' money. History will never forgive you all. And another one says, stakeholders' engagement since April, Abby, you guys should continue the lies. The day of reckoning is coming very soon for, 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 for you all at the, 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 the towers. Look at this. Mabumi Olumayokun says that we are suffering, guys. Petrol at 145 naira per liter. And our salaries are yet to move from the days of 97 naira per liter. There is God. Though. Let me also add that not just your uh, salaries haven't moved. Those of you who are earning anything at all have been divided by half due to unemployment mm-hmm. and so on and so forth. I, I like the tenacity of our people. I, I like the fact that, you know, they, they, they stuck to it and, and they were able to put, you know, put this nonsense away. Uh, the, the NNPC has said that uh, it is part of their stakeholders' engagement. It's stakeholders' engagement for a whole National Assembly to host them to a dinner. And I want to, I want to imagine... What kind of dinner but that the, would be? The people have the pies. What you actually believe in? Because sometimes, as we get to, we get to urge these people on. We see them, take selfies with them. But when well, we are learning, as one, we are learning. Now that we could do this, we should do more. We are learning, and that's that's the beauty of you know of this all. We're learning. Nigerians are becoming more and more discerning. We're learning, and it was public pressure that stopped this nonsense from going on. Uh, Peter Patewa says those moving to endorse Buhari for second term are uh, insincere as can be. What's Buhari's scorecard to deserve a return ticket? Uh, Gwadi Geshe says, uh, Gwadi Geshe says, PMB shouldn't even think of getting the ticket for 2019 as such neck meeting. He should know better. Convention is the right place. 
Oyekuli assures her is as, as asking Zessel governance in Lagos. Roads are bad, filth everywhere, robberies every day. I, I deserve any comment about uh, the Lagos State government. I don't, I don't want to, I'm not interested in making any comment on that. And um, Olukayade says, our institutions exist only in names. Our constitution was designed with no intention to fight graft. And uh, Charles Chidozier says, APC will be shooting themselves on the foot if they eventually in, in the foot if they eventually decide, eventually endorse Buhari as a candidate for 2019. And um, Richard Unzube Chuku says, the people gunning for PMB for 2019 are determined to totally destroy Nigeria. I pray more people indicate for 2019. Onubisi says, so who was to pay for NNPC dinner? We love wasting public funds that would have been used for development. <laughs> the dinner wasn't by ticketing. It was by invitation. Mm. I want you to imagine, Buki, just for one second. It will cost to, uh, in a nice restaurant, a dinner per head, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, buddy, will be between 10,000 and 15,000 naira per head, minus the wine and the champagne. And you're not going to be hosting members of the National Assembly and giving them soft drinks and water and juice. No, they won't settle for that. So I just want you to sit back and imagine. So what, how, what, what exactly was the agenda for that? Host? It was a stakeholders forum to carry them along. I want you to imagine. All don't, don't forget that. Don't forget that this dinner would also go with gifts, both, both seen and unseen. I, I don't know if you know that. It would also, and then there'll be other VIPs that'll be invited. Some people will be paid to attend. You, you understand? Some people are paid to attend events. You know? So I want you to imagine what the budget, I'm going to try and get into Gamadu and ask him to please give me a rundown of how much they budgeted for that dinner. William says, Do you think the money meant for the dinner won't still find its way to the lawmakers' pockets? The money would have gone to the hotel, you pre book. <laughs> the, gift, the gift items, both in, 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 maybe in, in, in kind, and probably in cash. Once it gets out of the, the, the treasury, it's not going to go back. We know the way these games are played. We don't, it's part of the frivolity. And, and people think that. Some people are suspect. You know the National Assembly have said they want to probe the, uh, the NNPC MD. What a coincidence that, that it is when the National Assembly wants to probe the NNPC MD that it now hosts them to a dinner. How do you describe that kind of coincidence? Well, they, they just realized they were stakeholders. All right, we'll take a break. Okay, I think you were invited to that. News and analysis. We'll be right back. Life is more beautiful when you allow yourself to appreciate the little things. Uh, the little things. Uh, every day is more complete when you can enjoy uh, the simple things. Uh, the simple things. Uh, a little more convenient. I go a long, long way. You'll be amazed how much time you save. Yo, when you leave the star nine of four hash, you like star nine of four hash. Oh yeah, I'll pray to sharp, sharp, retired like pam, 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 pam. Star nine of four hash. Wherever you are to reload is easy like pam, 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 pam. Star nine of four hash. Shells down, star nine of four star. The amount you want to recharge, young hash. And with one single dial, you recharge like pam, pam, pam. pam. Airtime instantly, directly from your bank account. Simply dial star 904 star, the amount of airtime you want and hash. You're tuned in to the front page news on Classic FM 97.3. So front page news and analysis on Classic FM 97.3. And uh, we take some Metro News now. Yes, okay. let's take some Metro News. Thank you. And there's another one. Thank you very much. Okay, let's start, let's start with, the, with the punch. Um, the punch says that um, the FCC may place a bounty on expansion thief. Chief, sorry, excuse me. Let me read again. The FCC may place bounty on expansion chief. Mena family demands panel of inquiry. What what does it mean by bounty? Just in case somebody's out there that doesn't know, means that they'll put a prize on his head. Okay. A controversy over OAU student suicide. Oh my God. The suicide of a 16 year old student of microbiology department of OAU, Ife, Miss Mercy Afolaomi, has continued to generate ripples in the institution. 
Afala Rami, who is in 100 level, reportedly took rat poison on Thursday because of her poor grade in a compulsory course in chemistry. That is very, very sad. Very, very sad. But I think there's some controversy over that. It might not just be that. It could have been uh, an emotional thing. Or it could have been a mental imbalance. May her soul rest in peace. Driver kidnaps boss's brother, girlfriend, over loan requests. A driver, you know, you better be careful with drivers. Driver kidnaps boss's brother, girlfriend, over loan requests. Woman gets 10 years for cocaine trafficking. A 56-year-old mother, woman, and mother of four, Modino Tuwulabi, was on Tuesday sentenced to 10 years for cocaine trafficking. Two IMSU, what is IMSU now? IMSU is Imo State University. Students returning from Beria die in auto crash. Man defiles 14-year-old. Relatives knock out guardian's tooth. Wow. Police search for friends of lovers found in dead car. You know, there was this story, I think it was on Monday, of uh, two lovers who lived in the same house. Both of them were married. You know, they went for some rollicking somewhere and they found two of them dead in, in, in the car. That, that would be probably be a case of uh, some traditional interference. It, it was said on the news that the, the, the husband of the other woman, of the woman involved, had always suspected his wife. And maybe... Uh, um, you know, maybe that could be some traditional um, whatever. We can't say categorically. I said maybe. No. I use the word maybe. Uh, if if it's not that, but is just deliberately ignoring me. I would have asked him because but is knee deep in Yoruba traditions. He will understand these things. Okay, Ashafa laments non-completion of National Library building, and then the early false police arrest of drug. Dealers. Talking of National Library, I hope we can. Well, I hope that at some point all the local governments will ensure that they have at least three or four libraries in their local governments for students to have a place to go and read. They can, for example, they, of course, you'll be talking about paucity of funds, but you can go to various organizations in those areas and get them to sponsor. Uh, you know, I, I wanted to initiate a library project uh, at some point in the past. I think now this has this will probably energize me to go through it. Get the public, you know, private sector to for all of us to put. We need to educate our youth and provide the environment. There's so much poverty. The least you can do is provide libraries for children to develop. So I'm I'm happy that I I, 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 I driving along Habar Macaulay um, about two three weeks ago. I, I saw that a, a bank had had upgraded the library there. We'd like more of that to happen. I mean, I spent half my time in libraries when I was young in Lagos here. Now, in the vanguard, you have mob lynches three over Okada theft in Ondo as police film over jungle justice and threaten arrest. And um, also in the vanguard, you have um, Luther's trial. NJC replaces Salami with Galadima. I might as well comment on that now. I was going to comment later. I, I, well, Justice Galadima has taken up, taken up the mantle. I would have thought that the NJC would have used the opportunity of uh, uh, um, Justice Salami's refusal to again look at the you know at the panel or the the committee that they set up to work with because there was strong criticisms against certain persons in, you know in, in that committee but uh, they have overlooked that and so that's it. Jonathan Dasuki asked Justice Abang to hands off Metu's trial. Babacha Sack, we've been vindicated, said the Senate, and say the Senate have vowed to continue to expose corruption. I'm happy about you know them being resolute but as they do that they should also look in the mirror and sometimes see what they can find you know see if they can also find corruption amongst themselves nigeria needs em emergency acceleration to get out of its challenges south south leaders back Yugun condemn youth protests in abuja there was a youth protest in abuja yesterday against the apc chairman ndyc flays attacks on intels urges buhari's intervention you know the story of intels pookie and post authority, and they're now urging Buhari to intervene. No, he won't. Uh, we must, there must be due process. That's, that's what I, I don't believe Buhari should intervene. There must, we need to let systems take care of themselves. Acquire bomb HI, HI1 partner to scale up family planning method. This will be a good delight to my good friend who I always calls him down the corridor, Comrade Akman. Even, even now, he would like to hear this. Okay, um, Queen of Netherlands visits somebody, Lord Lagos Health policy. Oh, by the way, I hope that the doctor's quarters that was refurbished on the marina will soon be allocated to, to the doctors, you know, the doctor, next to the burnt net building. 
They have the doctor's quarters. It's been renovated. It's looking quite nice. I hope nobody's going to divert those quarters from the doctors and the doctors will be allowed to move in there. All right. So that ends the news, the Metro News for today. As uh, Stanley says, good, oh, okay. Um, Mukachicha says, Buhari's intention to expand his cabinet will be resisted. Nigerians want development and empowerment, not appointment of politicians that will steal our common wealth. Well, if, 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 uh, you know, again, some, for example, people are saying, it's been long overdue there, some people need to throw out of there. And people are saying that, and I'm beginning to feel that maybe they're right, that three ministries are too much for Fashola to handle. Yeah, I mean, let's, let's look and see. Let's, we've tried him for two years. Um, I don't know how much progress we've made on that. So let's see if we can relieve him of this burden and stop the man from aging and growing gray hair almost in rapid succession. Unche Amej says, Nigeria is a country governed by people who seem not to have traveled outside the country. Main gate, Baru gate, how many gates are we going to see before the end of this administration? Is this the Buhari we craved for as Mr. No-Nonsense of 2015? Mm. And um, Dakwa Banja says, for the NNPC dinner, we should give them the benefit of the doubt. Dinners, lunches happen everywhere to move things forward. And this next one coming from Obafemi, he says here, Buhari will get 100% votes from the North because the reason why the vote is not the same reason with the South is not the same reason with the Southwest. Akishemo, uh, dinner was cancelled, but money has already been spent. The more you look, is the less you see. If anything, invitations have been printed, mm -hmm. restaurants would have been booked. So probably the dinner still went on in spite of all that. Uh, the, it, like I said, the funny thing about government is that once something comes out of the treasury, ah, it won't go back home. Bolu Inka says, Uncle Jimmy, what do you mean by traditional interference? Please call a spade a spade and let's simply call Margo its name. I don't know about that, but, but, they, but they has refused, he's refused to advise me on that. He's my special advisor on traditional matters. Okay. Our great benevolent accomplished giver gone. There was an outpour of emotions yesterday at number one Funcha Martin Street Park via State Ikoyi residence of the late retired Air Vice Marshal Olufunsho Martin. Uh, relatives, colleagues, and most elderly sympathizers expressed shock that the accident, which also claimed the life of Martin's driver on Saturday night. A very sad weekend for me. Um, Avian Oluf Olufunshaw Martins was my senior in school. Fine gentleman, an officer and a gentleman. And um, he, he was the one who owned the vehicle that ended up in the lagoon, you know, some Ford, I think Ford uh, Jeep. And uh, may, may his soul uh, rest in peace. And people are paying um, tribute to him. What is most important, the lesson to learn from what happened to him. We, we don't know the full facts. But what I do know, because the, the jeep app apparently tumbled from the road, from the bridge, down into the water. Um, my advice to people is, look, a jeep has a V6, V8 engine. But you must have a... It, by the way, it was driven by a driver. And it was at night. Uh, and um, drivers must know that you cannot drive an SUV like a salon car. You, you, you know, you just cannot drive an SUV like a salon car. It was said that he was hit. Most likely, only God knows how fast any of the vehicles were going. Uh, but it's just um, unfortunate. He's somebody that we're going to miss a lot in Lagos. You know, I'm both in my old boys association. And all I can ask is that, you know, may God comfort his family. And may his gentle soul. Rest in perfect peace. I think on that note, I'd like to leave. All right. Uh, Can I? You're free to. Thank you. Your time is up here. What do you uh, mean my time is up? <laughs> <laughs> it's time for Sports Express. At least you made me smile after this. <laughs> Life is more beautiful when you allow yourself to appreciate the little things. Uh -huh. The little things. Uh -huh. Every day is more complete when you can enjoy uh -huh. the simple things, uh -huh. the simple things, uh -huh. a little more convenient can go a long, long way, you'll be amazed how much time you save you when you leave the star 904 hash and life, star 904 hash, oh yeah, upgrade to shop, shop, retired life, pam, 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 star 904 hash, wherever you are to reload is easy like pam, 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 star 904 
airtime instantly, directly from your bank account. Simply dial star 904 star, the amount of airtime you want and hash. And that's it on the front page news on Classic FM 97.3. Stay tuned. Classic FM 97.3. This is Sports Express. This program is brought to you by MTN. Algeria picks strong squad for Super Eagles World Cup tie. In Chelsea, routed in Rome, PSG and Bayern ease into the round of 16 from Tuesday night's action in the UEFA Champions League. My name is DJ Amato Imbo. Welcome to Sports Express, brought to you by MTN. Hello, I just got back from the States and I need to buy a SIM, you know, so that I can have a number, you know, catch up with folks and peeps, yeah? Auntie, na nyafu nyafu bonus you need. What's yafu nyafu? If you join MTN, eh, you go enjoy this bracket. Eh. What's bracket? You feel do anything we like with the bonus, chat, you know, browse, you know, text, you know, call, you know, to all network for Nigeria. No condition, complete freedom, everything, no buckle. Excuse me, I don't understand. What's buckle? For example, now, eh, if you recharge 100 Naira, they go give you 6 Hundred naira. If not two hundred naira, they go give you one thousand two hundred naira. Eh, hey, bros, ye yeah, show me the way now. Get an MTN sim, activate it, and get six times of all your recharges every time you recharge. Also, enjoy free data to download, chat, and do much more on MTN deals. Only. Sister, you be here like this now. You can't deform, bros. You know now, nah, now nah packaging. <laughs> Many thanks for joining us on Sports Express, brought to you by MTN. We wrestle with athletics on international newsreel. Former meters world and Olympic champion with Van Niekerk has been ruled out of the 2018 Commonwealth Games due to a knee injury. The 25-year-old South African who was planning on competing in 100 and 200 meters races in Australia will miss the event after damaging his ligament during the Celebrity Touch Rugby game in Cape Town. Next year's Commonwealth Games will hold in at Australia's Gold Coast in April, and the tournament will come too soon for Vanike, who now requires surgery to get back to shape. And in tennis, 2015 Davis Cup champion Carl Edmond battled past Evgeny Donskoy to advance to the second round of the Paris Masters on Tuesday. The 22-year-old saved a match point as a fought back to defeat his Russian opponent 5-7-7-6-3 to book a place in the next round. In other results, Dominic Thiem, Fernando Vedasco and Adrian Manarino all progressed into the second round while Sam Query and Pablo Carina Buster have both been knocked out. Now to the NBA, Buddy Ogutu is here before Buddy joins me results from the five matches played overnight. Um, Indiana Pacers took out Sacramento Kings 101-83. Demantas Bonis, Demantas Bonis had a double double, 12 points and 16 rebounds. Phoenix Suns edged Brooklyn Nets 122 114. It was Oklahoma City Thunder over Milwaukee Bucks 110 91. Steve Adams and Russell Westbrook both had double doubles. And Paul George scored 20 points. Janice 28 points. And LA Lakers took out Detroit Pistons 113 93. What do you could see? He's here, like I said, buddy. Janis, good scoring night again, and um, but Oklahoma City now four and three. Just too good, just too good. Um, Janis is um, uh, how will I put it? About the only grown man, in basketball wise, in in in, in, uh, in the box team, they've been playing well and like a lot, like like most young teams, they're gonna have great nights, they're gonna have off nights, and just in case they are cold, just put his finger on it. Uh, we played against grown men today, and my boys are not ready. They must know that if they want to play, that if for them to, to remain uh, to remain uh, re- relevant in this league, they want to bring their best game every night. And I think that's just some sub their night. But by the end of the th- third quarter, the game was almost done. Um, uh, but uh, uh, like I said, Janis J- J- kept pumping. I think it's a learning curve curve for, for the box. I believe that uh, just like last season, they'll be in the playoffs, and depending on who they get in the first round, they probably get to the, to the semifinals. But a good landing curve and also a, a good turnaround for, uh, for, for, uh, for, for Thunder too. They've had some update this season. Both of them are 4-3 now. I wait to see which of them will, uh, will get um, uh, out of the box faster. The other game, they, 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 uh, they, they, they won that run in, into this morning. Pistons against, against Lakers. A good win for the Lakers. You want 1393 against um, uh, a fairly good um, uh, Pistons team. And uh, like it was noted, this is the third game that Lonzo Ball will play well. 
and this, this is the third game that Lakers will win. He, is, he, he remains the fulcrum of, 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 of the Lakers attack. He, picks, but he makes everybody around him better. Now, if, if you look at the start box, uh, his plus minus are, um, are written. It's like it's, it's at, at plus, plus eight. Uh, about about um, one, one of the lowest in the team. The other side plus 17, plus 15. But he's the one that makes everything happen. But like I, I, like, but I, like I said at, at, the, at the start of the season, keep your eye on, on Kyle Cosma. Again, 16 points in 17 minutes. This boy is a, is a point scoring machine. Mm. Uh, I, any, anytime he gets on the floor, he proposes to rebut. I think Lakers have a good young core. They might not make the playoffs this season. They might, they might not. But I think over the next two seasons, we are going to see the Lakers brand mm. go back to what they, the, what they are. Playing fun basketball, making the fans happy. Golden State and San Antonio tonight, buddy. I'm not looking forward to that game. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can tell you that uh, because uh, if, like, if, if, the, if the Warriors are good, they are very good. But when they are bad, they are terrible. But the sports, like I said, their defense is not too good. But you can't ha- afford to have, to have a last defense against that Warriors team. Uh, that's when they get hot. They just destroy you. 140 points last night. I don't want to face the Warriors now. Really. All right, we shall see what happens tonight. Of course, we'll break it down for you tomorrow. But hey, still around because when we return after the break, we we'll bring you the Nigerian sports scene. Life is more beautiful when you allow yourself to appreciate the little things, uh-huh. the little things. Uh-huh. Every day is more complete when you can enjoy uh-huh. the simple things. Uh-huh. The simple things uh-huh. A little more convenience Can go a long, long way You'll be amazed How much time you save you When you leave the star 904 hash And life Star 904 hash Oh yeah, great to shop, shop, retire Like pam, 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 pam Star 904 hash Wherever you are to reload is easy Like pam, 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 pam Star 904 hash Shows down star 904 star The amount you want to recharge and hash with one single dial, you recharge like bum, 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 bum. Buy airtime instantly, directly from your bank account. Simply dial star 904 star, the amount of airtime you want and hash. Welcome back to the show. It's Nigerian Sports Scene on Sports Express brought to you by MTN. But even to you still here. And buddy, we here uh, Algeria uh, have picked a very, very strong squad. But first, before we get to the Algeria, and um, there's a story making the rounds. Uh, maybe you can confirm that the Super Eagles have so far in this was it this calendar year? I think spent three billion naira to five. prosecute. Is, is it okay? Yeah, three, three billion. Three billion For to the prosecute five so far. The five matches so far in the World Cup qualifiers. That that's an minus. average of... Um, that is... Hold on. Hold on. Mm. That's minus the money spent by the Aqua, Aqua Bomb State government. The host government. The, 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 this is the money that's f- from the federal government. Now, the person who, who gave the information was specific. It wasn't money to the NFA. It was to the Super Eagles for World Cup qualifier. Now, um, that's... Uh, Not even money for the other teams? No. Oh, okay, the Super Eagles, mm. and uh, in this economy, that's a lot of money. The World Cup, the World Cup qualifiers are not done yet. There's still a game left to play, mm. and and it's also it's, it's also exclusive monies that were given by FIFA to help the nation prepare for qualification. Wow. And honestly, that's a lot of money. It's mind boggling. Um, it's mind boggling, and I because that's on the average. That's on the average five games, three billion. Almost that's on the billion. average about seven fifty. Yes, per game. I, I think I think the NFF account should be audited. Six hundred million naira per game. I think the NFF, NFF account should be audited. Um, uh, the, the, the key word around the world now is um, how do, how, these accounting people. How do, how do you put it? But due it, process, uh, due process and accountability. accountability. And I think we can't be left. Out. We can't be talking about global best practices only when it suits us. My worry about all of this is that um, our all football experience seems to be only targeted towards. This qualifying for the World for the Cup, World Cup yes. qualifying for the World Cup, and I really don't see the impact in other aspects of our game. And you're talking about the uh, other national teams don't even get to have the monies they need for key things. So I'm I, worried I, about that. You, we have said it over the years. Um, uh, the the the, the monies that the NFF receive when they go play at the World Cup, we never know where the money goes. Mm. We never know mm. uh, because um, we talk about qualify, qualify. The fragments are saying that they are paying the bills. Uh, now, um, at the, when the money comes, the NFF says that this money is the money you are going to use for the for our programs. 
I, I and I remember at the last um, uh, at, the, at the last hearing uh, at the at the, at the House of Reps or the Senate, when the NFF pre presented presented their budget for next year, the money from the World Cup was not captured in it. Mm. And so, some people argue that is is because that money has not been paid yet, and so it cannot be captured. Did you look? You can talk about this for for whole, for whole hour. Okay, let's quickly, go, let's let's go to the football. Quickly, um, Robert Maja has picked a very strong sword. I, well, it's a dead Robert game, but I think he sees it as a new beginning and a new start for his team. And at this point, I want to apologize to General Trump for the team he picked. We, we thought that he, he could use uh, use the use the mm. game to to test on some players. They just want to win it. We, we don't want to hand them that um uh that confidence or that uh, that uh, feel good factor. So let's go there, let's go there and give it our mm. best shot. And then uh, the, 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 the international are saying that they, they, they want to float uh, their shares in the stock, stock market. You don't, you, you don't just announce it. Shooting stars plan to sell season tickets like four years ago. You don't, you don't just announce it. You've got to do the groundwork. And Bode was it's, looking for season ticket I'm, to I'm buy. You've got, you've got to do the, do the groundwork. It goes beyond just announcing uh, and announcing to, to everybody. You've got to do the groundwork. And before I go, Deji, in case you missed it, mm -hmm. share your love in general. Yeah, former Kwara United and Super Group's midfielder. And Wolves midfielder. Is the Wolves under 23 coach. Wolves wow. Wolves Hampton Wonders is the, the Wolves uh, under 23 coach. That is massive. And in case you don't know, he has a PhD yeah. in petroleum engineering. Yeah, I'm moving I on. Know that. Great guy. Thank you very much for that, buddy. When we return from the break, all about the we have a Champions League on the World Soccer Report. Bros, look me well. Anything changed for my face? I find pass as I be before. Overco, see this one, oh. Who they give you up, sir? Today, eh? Yeah, but I want to play with her money. Dash me food. I say, make she summon me hundred naira garage. She can't give me four times. Go even put plenty of rishish on top. Ah. Oh, wolves. This one when be say your luck, they shine where we like flood lights, so. No be every day better than the touch light to you. But with MTN, I will for you. Every day na Christmas. Because anytime you recharge with above 100 naira, MTN go summon you three. 300% bonus. Meaning say, you could get four times the value of your bonus where you go fit take browse, text, and call any network as you like. No condition. Just dial star 888 star recharge pin hash. Make you begin enjoy this better move. This now for only MTN prepaid and post with customers. Terms and conditions day. It's a Wall Soccer Report on Sports Express brought to you by MTN Your Medicine is here. Before we get to the Champions League, there's a little story from the Premier League. Watford captain Troy Deeney has been given a three-match ban after accepting violent conduct charge for grabbing Joe Allen's face and neck in the game against Stoke at the weekend. Here for Champions League, matches played Group A, Manchester United 2-0 over Benfica. You have to feel sorry for the young goalkeeper's familiar. I don't think you want to play United for a while. Never. Basel won CSK Moscow 2 and that the result that result means United have not qualified just yet but uh, although realistically you have to say they are through. Uh, in group B, Celtic won Bayern Munich 2, PSG 5-0 over Anderlecht. Both PSG and Bayern Munich are through from there. Group C, Roma routed Chelsea 3-0, Atletico Madrid can't get going. 1-1 one -one with Carabao, you would have thought that the Atletico will get two points from two games against Karabakh, but that's what's happened. And in Group D was Olympiacos shutting out Barcelona 0 0. They played against the Spanish champions, I'm sorry, the Spanish giants. And Sporting were held by Juventus 1 1. So interesting night, Yemi. And you have to say that um, Chelsea, something is not just right. I haven't seen a worse, <laughs> was it worst? <laughs> Defending, piece of defending by mm. any team in a while. Uh, Roma just did the basics. They went back to school, went old school, long balls into spaces, and all Jekyll needed to do was running between two center Center's defenders Bayern. and knock the ball down for a Sharawi to finish off. Third goal was just schoolboy stuff. One mm. man, three players, provided good escort service for him. And mm. he just cut back and laid the pass for priority. I don't know. You know, we said we talked about Chairman Bakayoko Baka yeah, in yeah. the preview yesterday. Mm, mm. Chelsea can't wait to have I, yeah, back. I think it's just he it just has a. I, I like to give him benefit of the doubt because prem, players come to the Premiership and it's tough and, to adjust. Yeah. You know, so let's be fair to him. But his right now his positional game is just right. totally off. So they really, really need Kante back. 
All right, let's go to tonight's games because Man City, Besiktas, Spurs, and Real Madrid could qualify from tonight. Liverpool play Maribor and Sevilla plays Spartak Moscow in Group E, Group F. Napoli play Man City, Shakhtar, Donetsk play Feyenoord. Group G is Porto against Leipzig and Besiktas host Monaco. And in Group H is Spurs, Real Madrid, Dortmund, Apoel, Nicosia. You have to be very fast on this one now. You mean Spurs, Real Madrid, Man C- Napoli, Man City. Spurs, Real Madrid, two teams who need to bounce back from league defeats. Mm. So this is all to do in this game. A draw in the first leg, everybody went up your hands about how good Spurs were. But hey, they have to prove it on <coughs> this night because hey, now both of them are close and looking and edging towards qualification. Yeah. Napoli and the San Paolo are a different animal completely. Play really good football. The pace of the front three will continue to worry any defensive yeah. one. And that means for Alan and Giorgio, the best passes of the ball in Syria right now, City have their work to do. If they crush both of every other team, this one will be a lot tougher. But there will be goals to see in both games that we just talked about. We hope so. Thank you very much, Jamie. The best of the rest is from boxing. From WBA, IBF, WBO, and IBO champion Tyson Fury has revealed that he intends to emulate boxing legend Muhammad Ali by returning to the ring after years on the sidelines to reclaim his titles. Ali was stripped of his World Heavyweight Championship and spent four years out before returning to eventually reclaim his titles against George Foreman in the Rumble in the Jungle. A feat which Fury wants to emulate with Anthony Joshua, his first target. We shall see. Thanks for coming along for the ride on Sports Express brought to you by MTM. My name is DJ Montembo. Good morning. Life is more beautiful when you allow yourself to appreciate the little things. Uh-huh. The little things. Uh-huh. Every day is more complete when you can enjoy uh-huh. the simple things. Uh-huh. The simple things. Uh-huh. A little more convenient. Can go a long, long way. You'll be amazed how much time you save you when you leave the star nine of all. Yeah, I'm great to shop, shop, retired like pam, 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 pam. Star 904 hash. Wherever you are to reload is easy like pam, 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 pam. Star 904 hash. Shows down, star 904 star. The amount you want to recharge and hash. And with one single dial, you recharge like pam, 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 pam. Buy airtime instantly, directly from your bank account. Simply dial star 904 star. The amount of airtime you want and hash. This has been a Spot Vision production. This program was brought to you by MTN. Yesterday. 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 Today. Today. We've got you covered. We've got you covered. 24 7. 24 7. 24 7. We are Classic FM and we play every song you know. You were to describe Africa through art, would it be with music? In picture, dance, drama, or painting? Discover art in every form you imagined at Art X Lagos. It's the 2017 edition of Art X Lagos, refreshed by Seven Up. Over 60 artists from 15 countries, all at one venue, showcasing the best of Africa through spectacular contemporary art at the Civic Center, Victoria Island, from 4th to 5th of November 2017. Africa through art with a real div. Proudly sponsored by Seven Up. Seven Up, the div is clear. Around 7 o'clock, all the generators come on. My daddy calls them noisemakers and he doesn't like running our own, especially at night. But because of my baby sister, we have to. One day, daddy came back with one yellow box. He said it was the Loomis yellow box and it will give us light. I didn't believe it until he put it on and we had light. Now I can watch all my cartoons and sleep with the fan on. It is very quiet and it doesn't do green, green. And my daddy says it is cheaper than noisemakers. Go to the MTN store near you and join the Lumos Mobile Electricity Service with a 19,000 Naira one-time setup fee and 4,500 Naira monthly subscription. Valid while stocks last. Terms and conditions apply. Passports? Check. Check. 
Tickets? Check. Standard chartered visa credit card? Of course. Daddy, don't forget my jersey. I'm walking onto the beach with Daniel's storage. <laughs> don't worry, I have it. Stand a chance to be rewarded with a trip to a Liverpool FC game or have your child be a match day mascot when you spend at least 10,000 naira 10 times or a minimum of 250,000 naira respectively with your Visa Gold or Platinum credit card before 16th of December 2017. Autograph jerseys and Liverpool FC goodie bags also up for grabs. Terms and conditions apply. Visit www.sc.com slash ng for more. Standard Chartered Bank. Here for good. In today's tech-driven world, where everything is connected, a world where automation is king, your driveway gate should not be left behind. Take absolute control of your gate with Centurion Automatic Gate Systems. Operate your gate remotely from your car or inside your house. Centurion Automatic Gate Systems also offer you the convenience of operating your gate and providing access to visitors from anywhere in the world with an optional GSM device. Centurion Automatic gate systems are affordable, reliable, and will last a long time. Invest in the comfort, security, speed, and convenience of a Centurion automatic gate system today. Call Centurion now on 01-463-3115-0812-221-9202 or visit www.centurionwestafrica.com and find out how to conveniently take absolute control of your gate from anywhere. Insurance don't come again, yo. Ember month promo, don't land here. See, if I back, they always have my back. Eh. With one month free, I move. Yeah. When I move, they're always by my side. Oh. No matter what, then go stand. Giddy back, giddy back, giddy back. Eh. Get two month free motor insurance. Starting September 2017, enjoy one month free car insurance on any of our auto variants and other comprehensive packages at Cornerstone. We don't give you any hassle. Visit cornerstone.com.ng. Offer last to January 2018. Terms and conditions apply. Cornerstone, the future assured. In 2016, we had over 60 artists from 10 countries with 30 installations. In one venue, this year is going to be bigger. It's the 2017 edition of Art X Lagos, refreshed by 7UP, West Africa's first international art fair. Over 60 artists from 15 countries, all at one venue, showcasing the best of Africa through spectacular contemporary art at the Civic Center, Victoria Island, from 4th to 5th of November 2017. Experience various genres of art and more at Art X Lagos, Africa through art with a real diff. Proudly sponsored by 7UP. 7UP, the diff is clear. Attention online shoppers! Jumia Black Friday is back! From November 13th to December 13th, it's 31 days of mind blowing deals like the PlayStation 4, FIFA 18, and Dual Shock Controller Bundle for 114,990 Naira. Visit jumia.com.ng or download the Jumia app now! The Jumia Black Friday Festival 2017, in partnership with Intel, Pampers, Infinix, Philips, Faro, HP, MTN, and Air France KLM. Jumia, the online shop you can trust. Every night at around 7 o'clock, all the generators come on. My daddy calls them noisemakers and he doesn't like running our own, especially at night. But because of my baby sister, we have to. One day, daddy came back with one yellow box. He said it was the Lumos yellow box and it will give us light. I didn't believe it until he put it on and we had light. Now I can watch all my cartoons and sleep with the fan on. It is very quiet and it doesn't do groom, groom. And my daddy says it is cheaper than noisemakers. Go to the MTN store near you and join the Lumos Mobile Electricity Service with a 19,000 Naira one-time setup fee and 4,500 Naira monthly subscription. Valid while stocks last. Terms and conditions apply. Good morning, great morning. Which morning will it be? Don't forget to oh, at the rise of the rise of the sun with highly nutritious. Golden Morn, 
Highly nutritious, simply delicious. If you were to describe Africa through art, would it be with music? In picture, dance, drama or painting? Discover art in every form you imagined at ArtX Lagos. It's the 2017 edition of ArtX Lagos, refreshed by 7UP. Over 60 artists from 15 countries, all at one venue, showcasing the best of Africa through spectacular contemporary art at the Civic Center, Victoria Island, from 4th to 5th of November 2017. Africa through art with a real div. Proudly sponsored by 7UP. 7UP, the div is clear. This is me riding a roller coaster in Dubai. Wow! Me on top of the world's tallest building. <sighs> and me when I had to follow my mum shopping. So much stuff. Now is the best time to visit Dubai. Enjoy special fares from 899 US dollars and check in a third bag for free. Book until 17th November 2017 for travel until 30th of March 2018. Contact your travel agent or visit emirates.com slash ng. Conditions apply. Fly Emirates. Hello tomorrow. We are T minus one minute to take off. Commencing countdown. Five, four, three. Hold on, hold on, hold on. How high are we aiming to go again? To great heights. Exploring where no one has ever been. Let's get back to countdown. Five, four. Wait, 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 wait. Are you sure we have enough to take us that far? Yes. Visibility studies are good. Back to countdown. Five. What if we don't lift off? What if we lift off and fall back to the ground? What if? What if? What if? Uh, this this is flight control. Kindly abort the mission. Over. Sometimes in life, the fear of failure stops us from taking off and reaching new heights. At Custodian, we believe that life is like a game of trust. That's why we've got your back to help you soar. So while others say, what if you fall? We say, oh, but what if you fly? Custodian, exceeding expectations. In 2016, we had over 60 artists from 10 countries with 30 installations in one venue. This year is going to be bigger. It's the 2017 edition of Art X Lagos, refreshed by 7UP, West Africa's first international art fair. Over 60 artists from 15 countries, all at one venue, showcasing the best of Africa through spectacular contemporary art at the Civic Center, Victoria Island, from 4th to 5th of November 2017. Experience various genres of art and more at Art X Lagos, Africa through art with a real div. Proudly sponsored by 7UP. 7UP, the div is clear. We play only the classics. Keep it classic, keep it hot, and keep it moving. Keep it right here. Keep it 97373. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more. Don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more Hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more Oh, woman, oh, woman, oh Treat me so mean You're the meanest old woman that I've ever seen I guess if you say so I'll have to pack my things and go That's right, hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more Hit the road, Jack and don't you come back no more What you say? Hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more No more, no more, no more Hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more Now baby, listen, baby Don't you treat me this way Cause I'll be back on my feet someday Don't care if you do Cause it's understood You ain't got no money You just ain't no good Well, I guess if you say so I'll have to pack my things and go That's right, hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more Hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more What you say? I hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more Hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more Well Don't you come back no more What you say? Don't you come back no more I didn't understand Choose from 23 Emirates destinations in the Far East and discover something new around every corner. Visit Emirates.com. Fly Emirates. Hello tomorrow. Yesterday. 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 Today. Today. We've got you covered.
got you covered. 24-7. 24-7. We are Classic FM. Classic FM. 97.3. Every song you know.